Oh, honey, I have a present for you. No, I love presents. You do. Got you a thermometer, like a digital Let's thermometer. <laughs> well, I don't know. Maybe you want me to try it out? No. Oh, not. well, you could be the guinea pig I'll if you really it. want me to. Okay. I, I could do that. I'm okay. Oh, okay. We have this one. It's a wireless meat thermometer and it's brand new here, but I haven't even taken it out. But I did just put the app on your phone. That's why I stole it. Comes phone. with an app? Yes. So your app is going to beep, 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 beep when it's ready. No, but how, this stays in the grill? It's going to be super hot in the grill. This does. I know, but this can handle it? It says it can. You got to go in sideways. sideways. Yeah. I think you what need like an inch thick steak or something to do it. So it would probably do best in like It'll a... It'll work on these. Yeah. But this is... I am shocked it can I be, know. It feels just like a nail. It's we heavy. can't get rid of this. This is what it lives in and how it charges. So this goes in here and then this plugs in and charges. And this okay. is the Bluetooth thing. This Bluetooths to your phone. It's a soul can I tell it what BBQ. I, Bib IQ, I guess. Can I tell it what temperature? Yeah. You're doing beef, so you can choose what meat you want. Right. So let's see. Beef. Okay. Oh. Oh, oh wait, show them. So you got these choices. This is cool. Cartoon pit cow right here. You got you got Daffy Duck. Oh. oh. Anyway, so you hit what you want, and then you get to choose how you want it. This is if this works. I know. Okay, we are in. I said about one thirty, but it's one thirty six. Okay. That's medium rare. That's good with me. Yeah, me too. And then we'll if if their medium rare is not good enough, we'll either go up or down depending on yeah how it comes out. This is crazy. I know this is gonna be fun. So I need to cut I this just, off. I'm blown away that something like that. Can go I in know. That heat. I'm skeptical because things always die. The technology that's embedded in that has to survive that heat. Right. That could that could be used in a sauna. What if it worked in the smoker? What if it works in the sauna? Oh. You insert it. I don't know if. You insert it, and then when your core temperature gets to the right temperature. Okay. You just what it up. says you have to do is this goes in, you know, to this little line. Yes. That I got to wash it though. I just took it out. Okay. And then this needs to be near the unit, so like sitting to the side, but it can't get too hot. This. Yeah, but it can be. And then be... this is what talks to your phone, so you can be in the house. So I'll put it on a table out there by mm -hmm. the grill so it's not, and make sure it's not in the sun. Go fire the grill up so it starts getting hot. Oh yeah, go fire it up. This is gonna be a trip. This is gonna be so fun. Gadgets are so fun. I love them. Barbecue's probably hot enough. Yeah, but I also gotta keep, Steph was reading something, I have to keep the barbecue itself, the internal temperature can't go above what? This ceramic part can't go above 500 and 27 degrees. Oh, we're around 800 degrees out there, so I'll have to turn that down. Oh, great. But this yeah. can go all the way to 212. Okay, so the internal can handle 212, and we're trying to get to 136. 136. Easy. So we should be fine. Going in. I'm going in. Got to go all the way to the line. It said if it goes up too fast or something, It'll, uh, we did put these to room temperature of the steaks, by the way, so that it may not go up much or, oh, it's going down a little. Are you past the line? The line? Where's the line? <laughs> oh, I thought you were talking about the, the line. Top. Well, you crossed the line this time. The line is there. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay, so now it's ready. Okay, let's go see what happens out there. He's handling the meat way too much. Okay. Good thing that's his piece. Good thing it's his meat. Yeah, he's handling uh, his meat too much. Hey. Okay. Hey. Oh, dogs on me. Dogs on me. I can't move. You're going to have to drag your body out. <laughs> I can't move now. Look. What do I do now? Okay, I'm getting up. Holding you down. Are you ready for this, buddy? Yes. Feels weird sticking that in there with that thing. I know. It also said it can't be directly in a flame, but your flames aren't shooting up, so it's okay. Oh, jeez, all these rules. I know. So exciting. This one, I usually do this with tongue. I'm trying not to get it right on that front row. Well, we're testing it. Let's see if it works. We can go there. We I could... didn't want it to be in the sun. What about here? Five feet, five feet. Five feet? Yes. Right here. Okay, let's get your app awake. Now let me turn this alarm on. Ringtone one, sure. Saying the furnace temperature is 188. That's not bad. 
the steak's moving up to 59. Okay. I just won't oh, furnace the temperature head. says it's 201. So, Wait. are you? do you normally shut the head? Yeah, but I'm gonna go on this. Do it. Well, Let's just see what happens. I can watch this though and see if it goes up to 500 and something. Let's do it for a minute. Okay. And then I'm gonna flip them. So, see, we'll see what this goes to. 235, it says right now, for that little ceramic part sticking out. Let's it's beeping something. Okay, open the lid. Furnace temperature got too hot. Flip that thing or do something with that. It's having a crisis. It's still too high. I didn't know barbecues got that high. Oh, yeah, they got. Look at the thermometer gauge thing. I have to go to. goes up to 800. Wow. Well, we're pressing the limits right now. It said it can go to 500 and something, right? Well, the beef's at 71. Just that piece that's having an issue. I gotta shut it. All right. Let's see what it's up to. Watch this. Watch this. It says it's 347. Let's see what this says. I got it way low. But this is right on the grill where that is just got a thermometer in the lid. Maybe stick that other pro the probe on top of the other piece of meat. Yeah, like that. Maybe it'll be a little bit cooler there. Oh yeah, it's going down. Tell me when we get to 137. It's at 114. Okay, this just went down to 267. Whew, it's not having a crisis anymore. Okay, what's up with the... Uh, 120. Internal, internal's 120? Yeah, so now we know. We need to put that little probe on top of the other piece of meat. Just always keep it up. The thermos temperature, it says it's 249, so it's staying low. Just what does 40. that say? 400. Okay, but that might work then, just kind of shielding it with the other piece of meat. Yeah. Perfect. So 249, which is under the 302, which is great. And then we're at 123, it's getting closer. This is so fun. I love gadgets so much. This would work great in um, my toaster oven or my real oven to actually know what temperature it is. Hey, Alex. Hi, Alex. We're using a gadget. I thought I smelled something. We're yeah, using we an internal barbecue. Thermometer. Alex, you're growing so tall. <laughs> it's ridiculous. It's only 237 in there, but it's at 131. It's really so that is the way to do it. So that works really good. Yeah. Just shielding it with the other one. Perfect. Now we know. Anybody else getting one of these? That's the trick. Two, two degrees. Two. Is it going to alarm? We need two more degrees. Mm -hmm. And then we're popping it out. Yep. Okay. Let's err on the side of... of uh, a little bit rarer because we don't know what they're do you want it out now then 134 yeah let's try that because i don't want it to overcook i wanted the alarm to go off oh let it go then okay it's just starting to get the heat climbing again the internal heat i've got an unknown collar those scammers oh it's you nope. you had an unknown oh there it is ready food target temperature reached Woo! okay okay get out so it only got to 222 on that one. Get out. Get so cool like that it beeps your watch too. Steve has an Apple watch. So it's gone above, it's 143 now. So we're not gonna be, so it keeps cooking after. So next that's time we'll it. know when it gets close. You guys get to see these cuts and see if that's how we like it. I'll cut right in this part. Yes. Yep. Yes, that looks like we like it. And it went up too, like it went up to 100 and, oh, we forgot to Perfect. Buy it. Butter. Wow. That's perfect. Absolutely perfect. Mmm. Butter. It is perfect. I mean, that was successful. Yeah, that was a little St stressful. Stressful because we don't know what we're doing. It actually is perfect. It is great. Yeah, okay. this is a really juicy steak. Wow. That worked out perfectly. Now we know the trick. Just shield the ceramic from something else. From it. Direct heat. And then it's going to be fine. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. So it's a little mm. slower than how I cook, but I don't know what I'm doing. I'm I know we don't. the meat on there, flipping around. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. It's great. Then we don't have to mess with it either, like flipping it a few times. You just the one, one flip. Set the temperature. If it's, I wouldn't go higher than what it is now because this is like Perfect. right on. But it yeah. is still cooking when you get it off the grill. Yes, and now we know that too. So maybe we'll set it to rare or maybe if we can custom it we'll do it to like 130 and then it will keep cooking as it's getting out i mean and, i don't know how you guys but it's still medium rare yeah this is it's dripping to us 
Like this is how we like it. That's just perfect. I know a lot of people love to, they mm -hmm. swear you need to have your meat rest, but we have just been eating it juicy because yeah. it's still warm by the time we do it and we don't care. We yeah. like it this way to be juicy. Because we're eating everything, all the juice and all that, we're still eating that. We, yeah. we suck it up off of the board. I was just thinking about this the other day. So our little tray mm. here has a built-in knife mm. and a fork and the fork slots on my left. And I always eat with my right. I cut with my right and then I switch and take my fork on the right. And I see you're doing it with your left. I just, whatever hand I'm using at that time is what I do. Okay. So what you do don't, you do? I cut it and then I set it down and then I use my right hand. But I tried just now to do it with my left because maybe that's the way I'm supposed to do it. Whatever's more, like if you can handle your knife with your right. I don't think I could cut my knife. Oh yeah, I can't cut with my left. That's terrible. Try cutting with your left. It's... That is, I don't even know what the to do that, there. The way that you keep pointing your um, stuff at me. Utensils? Yeah, like points. Yeah, I can do it. I don't have a problem with Danger, it. danger. You don't? No. You're more ambidextrous than me. That's, that is a that good is, gadget. I can't believe it. That is perfect, the way the steak came out. Yeah. So I'm going to, I'll put a link to that gadget. It's on Amazon. I thought it wasn't going to be good because we were having a couple issues. But that's fantastic. Yeah. It is really a, a useful tool. Um, are you ready for your um, anal probe or yeah, whatever? Really, let me finish this steak and then we'll do we'll the see anal. see what your temperature. And see what my temperature is. The spike. But I think it's cool. This little thing is your charger. Really cool. This lives in it. You can watch this easily. Um, and and where's your phone? Tells you what's going on. Yeah. And it did it on your watch, mm -hmm. which is even better. Yeah. So that's great. So if we're doing something long, like maybe a smoker or something like that, that would be really cool. Cause you can do the smoker temperatures low. I think you do. So we're going to find out with that. Hmm. Hint, hint. Yeah. Okay. Thanks Any for joining us. Smoker. This is the soul BIBIQ. B-I-B-I-Q. An electric gadget exposed to a lot of heat that actually worked and we didn't kill it i think that's what i'm saying it actually worked yeah that's that's impressive awesome thanks enjoy your life enjoy your carnivore life yes